Today on FPV 101, we're going to do a quick breakdown so you can learn a little more about the components that make up an FPV drone. The first thing we're going to talk about are frames. The main thing that you need to know is the size of a frame is usually dependent on the size of the propellers that you want to run. Frames also have different durabilities based on the thickness of the carbon fiber. Let's move on to the avionics package. An FPV drone's avionics package is comprised of two things. The FPV camera and the VTX form a low latency video transmission system. And they're the reason you see video in your goggles. The radio transmitter package. The radio transmitter package is made up of the radio transmitter and the RC receiver. The next component is the power distribution board, also known as the PDB. The PDB's job is to take in power from the battery right here at the battery connector and distribute it to the other components in the system using these pads here. Then we have an electronic speed controller, or ESC. An ESC's job is to take in commands from the flight controller, otherwise known as the brain of the drone, and turn them into motor rotations. When building your FPV drone, using four individual ESCs, one per motor, and a power distribution board, you would usually solder ESCs to the power distribution board like so. In some cases, where you would want a lighter weight build, you would get rid of the four individual ESCs and the power distribution board and replace it with this one circuit board, a four-in-one ESC. But now it's just one board and you reduce the weight of the four ESCs. Motors and propellers. Now these are fairly self-explanatory, but the main purpose of motors and propellers is to generate lift needed to fly the drone. Antennas. An antenna's job is to receive or emit radio waves and turn them into electrical signals. An HD video camera. Now, an HD video camera isn't exactly necessary to the flight of your drone, but if you want to capture fantastic footage, mounting one of these to your drone is probably the best way to go about it. And finally, batteries. A battery is going to be how you power your drone. And generally speaking, when dealing with FPV drones, you're going to be dealing with lithium polymer batteries, which are so special because of the high discharge and recharge rate. Check out later episodes of FPV 101 for specifics on each of these components.